I am a New Zealander and I'm always looked at as a New Zealand, a Maori, very proud of who I am. My country is my country. Of course, you know, I've lived a long time out of the country, of course, then I make my home elsewhere. But the thing is, New Zealand is my home. Well, um, oh, gosh, it's, it's, it, it's always difficult because when I left here a few weeks ago, I went back to, to do a gala and some master classes with uh, Dennis O'Neill, who's coming down for the Lexus to judge the Lexus and then I went off to Washington for five days to, did a, to do a, a, a private concert for the uh, Academy of Achievement. Met uh, Henry Kissinger which was really nice. We stayed near the White House and then I went back to England to do, I can't remember what else I was doing and then of course preparing to come here. I can't remember what I was doing, I, just, I have to look at my calendar. And then uh, coming out here now I've got to go back and I've got a concert in a couple of weeks time but along with teaching and meetings and the Cardiff Singer of the World next year trying to get that on the right track because um, some of the things I'm, I'm, I don't approve of and being a patron I didn't think they'd, they'd think I was going to be quite so vocal so I need to sort of try and encourage them to sort of make the 30th anniversary something really special and so that's what I want to be involved in and then I go off to uh, Santa Barbara to do some teaching with Marilyn Horn at her school and to Chicago Ravinia to do some more teaching and a concert to Argentina I go there to, to judge come back do a concert here and there and just a lot of things, just a lot of things ongoing. It's every day, every day something to do. Well, just one last question. What, what does it like to do when you come back to New Zealand and you're back over the Bay of Islands? Right, well, it's just sit for a whole day and drink a bottle of champagne on the terrace and just look at the view. And that's, I suppose, what I do. I just get off the plane, make the drive up there and go to my favourite chair, a glass of champagne and just sit there and absolutely don't, I sort of soak in, just soak in what the smells and the life, whether it be rain, snow, shine, I don't care. I just stand there and just look at the wonderment of, of peace.